Hey what is going on this is Rob from Panther and today I'm going to show you a different trick how to create this kind of half tone text effect in Photoshop. I'm super excited to introduce you to Saji Habib, the man who designed some of the most famous logos out there such as National Geographic, Animal Planet, Harvard University Press, Showtime, and you probably know the bird with the colorful feathers, the NBC logo. He literally sold a logo that has a circle and a line under it and he shows you how he did that. You're gonna learn the basic fundamentals of logo design and he's gonna demonstrate to you what are the differences between good and bad logos. If you're that guy whose logos got rejected a thousand times then this course is for you. Saji Habib reveals his product process on how he demonstrates to the client what is a correct direction that will help the brand. You will find out how a professional logo presentation is made and what it contains. In this course you will learn fundamentals of logo design, case studies, design strategy, how to design logos like a pro and most importantly how to create your logo presentation. If you want to learn more click the link in the description and check it out. First step let's create a new file. Go to file click on new and type in 5500 per 5500 so to be a little bit bigger file okay click create let's select the type tool which is located right here click I'm gonna go with the letter X press ctrl T press shift plus alt and scale it up I'm gonna need to recolor this of course I'm gonna go here to recolor it there you go now go to the layer to the X right click and convert to smart object okay so from here we're gonna go to the filter go to blur gallery and select field blur now we're gonna place this little circle thingy right here and increase the blurriness I'm gonna click here somewhere and decrease the blurriness to zero and gonna add some more here Okay, and press here, okay. So we're gonna make a new layer. We're gonna make a layer that uh, has this X, but uh, without, you know, that can be adjusted. So I'm gonna press Control, Shift, plus Alt, plus E. So basically you can see here in the shortcut. So you get the main idea. And from here, let's go to the filter, go to the pixelate, select color half tone, okay? Uh, for the max radius, I'm about to type in 18 and channel 50, channel to 50, 50 and channel 4 to be on 0, okay, and click OK. And mainly this is how you achieve this half tone trick. So these areas I don't want to be with half tones because it was like a straight line without any blur effect. So I'm gonna go and mask this layer. Click on the mask, now you masked it. Select the brush, which is located right here. Make sure you're on the black color. And I'm also gonna increase the harness to maximum. And I'm gonna, you know, just delete these areas. Okay, so this is it. This is how you make this half tone blurry effect in Photoshop. And yeah, thanks for watching. And if you're new on the channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you get notified with daily updates. And also check out the rest of the videos. Have a good one. Bye bye.